<laughs> Jesus, watch it. When you're being hunted, it's easy to get scared by just about anything. Kitty, you scared me. Welcome to Watch Mojo, and today we're counting down our picks for the top 10 false scares in movies. For this list, we're looking at the best jump scares caused by something or someone non-threatening, as well as those high-tension sequences that turn out better than anticipated, and are basing our choices on a mix of scares, character reactions, and the ingenuity used to make something mundane terrifying. As is to be expected, a spoiler alert is now in effect. Number 10. The Attic – The Exorcist With enough suspense and not nearly enough light, even a breeze can be scary. When Chris decides to investigate a noise in her attic, all she has to light the way is a measly candle. Exploring the messy and noticeably rat-free space, she becomes very concerned with what caused all the ruckus in the first place. When something rattles again, she moves towards it. Suddenly, her candle erupts into a giant flame as a voice calls out to her. <laughs> Luckily, it's just her housekeeper, Carl, who informs her of the obvious lack of rats, giving her a righteous scare before demons enter the picture. Number 9. Door Hole – It Follows If your friends are being attacked, banging on a door is the last thing you should do. On the run from a personified STD, the kids move from their beachside hangout to a shack to protect themselves. After failing to kill the monster with a gun, they lock the door and back into a corner, while something begins to knock at the door. When the knocking stops, boards are blasted away with the kids bracing for the monster's attack. It turns out to be their friend Greg, who appropriately asks what's going on, leaving just in time for the real monster to pop in. Greg, are you okay? Greg? <laughs> Number 8. Bill Murray, Zombieland A good actor can fool the living, a great actor fools the dead. As Wichita and Tallahassee are partying it up in Bill Murray's mansion, they are quickly surprised by a zombie. When Wichita hits him, it turns out to be Bill Murray himself, who's been dressing as a zombie to fool the undead through the apocalypse. Ah! Oh, God, I'm on fire! Ouch! You're not a zombie, you're talking, what are you... you're okay. After some ghost-busting shenanigans, he decides to keep the fun going by scaring the very jumpy Columbus. Unfortunately, this backfires when he's so convincing that Columbus shoots him on sight, as Murray admits in his last moments it wasn't his finest idea. It was my bad. I was never a very good practical joker. So do you have any regrets? <laughs> Garfield, maybe? Number 7. Just Auntie – Prom Night Mirrors are perfect fodder for creeping up on people, whether you're evil or not. In this horror remake, Donna really has to keep on her toes when she opens her medicine cabinet, as bad things always seem to follow. On top of a dream sequence where she's thrown into the mirror by the killer, the scares don't stop in real life. <laughs> Getting ready for her big night, she heads for the bathroom to put some makeup on. As she closes the cabinet, she shrieks when she catches her Aunt Karen's reflection thinking she's the killer thanks to her inexplicable reasoning for silently sneaking up behind her. Oh, I'm sorry. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. I'm sorry. Okay. <laughs> Number 6. The Bus Stop – Cat People Fake-out scares are not as new as you'd think. In this vintage horror classic, Irina is supposed to turn into a panther whenever she becomes extremely emotional, especially when in love. Yes, ma'am. Like a leopard. But not a leopard. I guess that fits this fella. Yes, it fits him. After catching Alice at dinner with her beau, Irina follows her down the street, with Alice quickly sensing but never seeing her angry stalker. Control? That cat just walked over my grave. As Irina is poised to transform at any second and leap at Alice, a loud hiss cuts through the silence, turning out to be nothing but a bus. Thank <laughs> you. 
Named after the film's producer Val Luton, the Luton bus now refers to any similar scare with no actual danger behind it. You look as if you'd seen a ghost. Did you see it? Number 5. Train, the Leopard Man The Hollywood combo of Jacques Tourneur and Val Luton really enjoyed messing with their audience. After a club promotion goes bad, a leopard is set loose on a small New Mexico town, making it even more dangerous to wander at night. A leopard. They're big and they jump on you. Did you ever meet one of those things yet when you went to the store for me? Then you won't meet one this time either. Now get out. Already scared, Teresa goes out for groceries, <laughs> dealing with a frightening tumbleweed on the way. Crossing an underpass on her way home, she's scared out of her wits by a set of eyes. Before she can think, a train loudly passes by, scaring her half to death before she deals with the real danger ahead. Number 4. Reflections – Halloween H2O, 20 Years Later Turns out Michael Myers isn't the only one creeping up on Laurie Strode. After a scare from surprising Master of Horror Sheriff Brackett back in Haddonfield, who even startles the unshakable Dr. Loomis, you'd think Laurie would watch her back more often. Many years after the massacre and with a new life, the horrors of Michael would seemingly be behind her. I didn't exactly stay to see his ashes. 20 years. 20 years. Don't you think he would have shown up by now? Lori is still haunted by her dark past, however, as she continues to worry about Michael at every turn. <laughs> out on the town, Lori is shocked by Michael's reflection in a store window, when it turns out to be her boyfriend, Will, instead. Oh, oh Jesus, oh. Will. I'm sorry, I thought you saw me. You see me now? Number 3. Discovering Newt – Aliens In space, no one can hear you scream, at least when it's harmless. As Ripley returns to LV-426 years after the loss of her crew, she brings along some heavy-duty backup. As she and the Marines search an abandoned colony, they discover a handful of facehuggers and tubes, some even still alive. With the fear of the aliens at a new high, the crew is quick to act when they catch something on their motion trackers. Yo, Hicks. I think we got some here. With everyone reasonably on edge, they're ready to shoot a monster when they find the young Newt, who's been hiding alone in the vents. It's all right. Just Come grab on. her, Corporal. Don't be afraid. Come on. We won't hurt you. Shh, it's all right. Number two, dead body, Jaws. You're gonna need a bigger boat. You're gonna need a bigger bladder for this one. While the shark is definitely the biggest threat in this water-based horror, it doesn't even give the biggest scare of the film. As Brody and Hooper go out to look for the shark, they happen upon the sunken boat of Ben Gardner and decide to investigate. Ben Gardner's boat? That's Ben Gardner's boat. No? It's all banged up. Sure, I know he's a fisherman. What happened? As Hooper swims around, he discovers large holes in the hull and even finds a shark tooth stuck in the wall. As he takes another look, a victim's head pops up with a blood-curdling shriek, leaving him and the audience gasping for air. Before we continue, be sure to subscribe to our channel and ring the bell to get notified about our latest videos. You have the option to be notified for occasional videos or all of them. If you're on your phone, make sure you go into your settings and switch on notifications. Number 1. The Mask – Scream Huh? What am I doing? Hello? Knife or no knife, when you see a killer's mask, you assume the worst. As Sydney is comforted by her boyfriend Billy after a call from Ghostface, she becomes worried that they're one and the same, and hightails it out of the house. Said what? <laughs> Whoa, whoa, wait, wait. Much to her surprise, however, when she opens the door, she's confronted by the ghost face mask and screams in utter terror. <laughs> Lucky for her, the mask is being held up by Officer Dewey, who found it outside her house only moments before. Dewey gets his own false scare as he squeals in reaction to Sydney's more reasonable scare. Do you agree with our picks? 
Check out this other recent clip from WatchMojo, and be sure to subscribe and ring the bell to be notified about our latest videos.